Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Cyberpunk 2077. Alrighty, when we left off, we had, well, <laughs> been doing missions, mainly side missions, left and right, and we're going to do another one, uh, finding Sandra Dorset's uh, data bank. Since we're actually in the neighborhood, I figured we might as well do that. But I have some level ups and perk points I need to redistribute. So, redistribute is just distribute. So, let's see. Um, it's crafting, engineering. Eh, it's mainly crafting I've been diving into. Grants a 20% chance to craft an item for free. That'd be useful. Grants a 10% chance to upgrade an item for free. That'd be also useful. Hmm. And everything would require much higher level and technical ability than I currently have. Hmm. Let's do that for now. And then... Yeah, sure, why not? Put this in technical ability. All right. That should be fine. And now we head over to find Sandra's data bank. Luckily, it's a rather short jaunt from where I'm sitting. I could call the car. I probably should have. But, you know... Sprinting isn't that hard. Sprinting isn't that hard, and quite frankly, I go quick. Quick? <laughs> I guess is the word I was going for. I go quickly when it comes to sprinting. Well, quicker than I expected. Honestly, when I plotted that sentence out in my head, I was going with quite quickly. Uh, but for some reason, my mouth decided to skip half the words in the sentence. Introducing Alois Decan, a deadbeat with a pretentious name. Yeah, Gone sounds like it. trust and skip town. Oh. Well, fuck him. Oh. Only thing I care about now is the data he left in NC, specifically what's on his comp. Check the attachment. You'll see what to do. Alrighty. Thievery. Steal the laptop. The Corpo Mega Prick who cheated me, and not only me. There's a whole city out there that wants to get its hands on this guy. As they say, the fate of a traitor is sealed at the time of his betrayal. But what interests me beyond my vengeance is the data pad and, well, the data on it. Our traitor picked up and fucked off right out of NC so fast he left his gear in town. Just 20 minutes ago, I got a login ping from his camp, from his comp on an Eisenhower Street local net. Head over there and grab his device. Once we get it, we take advantage of this confused mess. Well, after I'm done with Sandra's data bank, I will get right on that. Assuming, of course, there's no one in here. Looks like there might be. So, uh... I have to be careful. Area hostile. Okay, well, I figured that much. That much I could at least glean from the fact that I had to break into this building. Mm, hello. That is a joy toy. This is a rat. Which I guess is the enemy type. Wanted for grievous bodily harm, assault, assaulting an NCPD officer. So, wanted for a lot of stuff. Gotcha. That's what I'm learning out of that. Uh, crud. Alright, well, that's the only way to finish it. Alright, exit. And... He's extremely weak to fire and electricity. 
So, pop. And pop. Well, allegedly they revealed my location. Oh, crap. Okay, you're probably the one who revealed my location. Okay, well, so much for doing this quietly. And Joy Toy is unharmed. Good. Oh, good boy. I was hoping that we could do it without accidentally killing someone who didn't need to die. Alright. There's another one. Okay. Not seeing anyone. Okay. Well then. Well. Grab your stuff. That stuff. Clinic access token. Access card acquired. For what? Where was the clinic? Alright. I was about to say, I wasn't sure if some of these guys actually survived my bullets or not. He keeps checking his gun. I'm starting to wonder. <laughs> Maybe I should be checking the gun. Alright. Your dollars... A lot of money just spread around. Huh? What do you mean, huh? Why am I hearing a huh? All right. Must be someone downstairs. It's the only thing that makes sense. All right. They came at me with a chef's knife. You're kidding. Alrighty, well. Down I go. Alright, uh. Mm hmm. A liberty, hey. Anything special going on here? Kabuki hit? Two merc. Okay. <laughs> I guess we're starting with this already. Two merc cunts hit our place in Kabuki. Came for Dorset and walked out over my brother's back. Asked the neighbors, and they say it was a big Tino and a young poser piece of shit. Excuse me? I ain't no poser. Fuck you. You know anyone in the afterlife? Ask around. I want names. This isn't over. New record, motherfucker. Remember our old bet? Well, I beat your records. 260 pounds of chrome ripped off of one guy. They have, they're doing records, they're, rather they're doing bets over how much chrome they rip out of people? Jesus. Some techie coming off his shift in Ario. Every step he took left a fucking crater in the sidewalk he was so heavy. Well, I put a stop to that, good citizen I am. Don't want him trashing our infrastructure. Right. And that means you owe me a cold one. Let me know when you want to hit the bars. Okay, so, I'm a little annoyed that they called me a poser, but, I mean, I'll show them in a bit. I'm just making sure I'm not missing any, uh, possible loot. Anything here? Nope. Just this. Oh, I can't connect to it! Bitch. Bitch. Ass. Wait a minute. They have a ripper here and I can talk to them? <laughs> Are you for real? <laughs> you for real? Wow. Okay. Death of a mercenary, author unknown. Quick enough, not I. Nor bold enough, nor agile. Tangled up in wires. Like a nest of vipers vile. Was it I who fell, or was it done to me? Dissolving, disappearing with you I wish to be. 
now tethered, clamoring the restless swarm, beating in my ears a pale rage. No, into the earth I sleep, my life the sweet. Thorn sticks in my throat, a chill burns brighter. On to what end? Uh, what a thought, a huddled husk, I tumble for the dawn. Okay, this is all poetry. And I think it might be above my head. I think. Maybe. Uh, well. So, Sojusil Dynamite. Well, I'm going to eat that. Just to keep my health all the way up. Uh, okay. Something. What is this? Is this what I'm supposed to be looking for? The data bank. Ah. Okay, well, I kind of want to see this ripper of theirs. Honestly. That? That is Johnny Cage. Album. Hmm. It's either in here, or it's on the other side of the wall. Either way, it's basically the same building, and that is hilarious. <laughs> if I could punch through this. If I could. That would be something. Alright. Okay. Well. Don't think there's much I can do in this room. Um, some more junk. Oh. That's some art. That's some quality culture right there. Alright, let's get into here. Oh. Pants. All of that for some pants. I hear someone asking for me. Or something like it. Ooh, a lot of money out of that one. I didn't go anywhere. Boot the optics. Oh fuck! They need to lay off those stims. Yeah, about that. To lay off a lot of things, like life. <laughs> okay. That's a bad joke. Okay, access acquired. Final record. Okay. Alrighty then. Militech incendiary round. Oh, the laptop was in the same area. Interesting. The last login. A Nova. All right. Who would have thought? Corporal or not, without Chrome, we all look like the same idiotic, bullet-ridden sacks of meat. Well, I mean, true. Guess he didn't skip town. He skipped life. I'm going to keep making stupid jokes like that, and none of you are going to be able to stop me. <laughs> well, the clinic... Seems to be upstairs, actually. Interesting. Hmm. Put my gun away. Because I... Head up here. Hey! Where'd you come from? It was just downstairs. You want to talk about this? 
I don't know what you saw there. I don't go down there. I don't know anything. They forced me. I'm their hostage. Said if I try to escape, I'd be next on the table. I swear. All right, all right. I believe you. A t terrible thing. I'm glad it's over. Yeah, are you? What kind of stuff you got? Well, if I'm here. <laughs> and they've already been ripped out of people. I mean, you know, might as well. EX disc. I would need 10 intelligence for that. Well, at least I own it, so I don't have to worry about it. Circulatory system stuff. I could add the feedback circuit. But it's not necessary. Bioconductor. Reduces all cyberware cooldowns. That would be nice. Let's see. What do they have available? Synaptic accelerator. It's already installed. And some of these I can't install yet because I need higher reflexes. And I already have what I can equip here. Legs, eh, arms. I'm not sure what I want to do with these. I'm kind of tempted to get the mantis blades, but at the same time, I'm very much tempted to get the projectile launch system. I have the money to buy it. I just... Mm, not sure what I want. And that's fine. Operating system. Running a Biodyne. Mark II. Yeah, no. There's no reason to upgrade. It doesn't have anything good. Anything good that I need, anyway. I already have... Hiroshi Optics, the best installed. There's no reason to worry about that. Uh, I need a lot of body before I start doing these. Sin lungs. Hmm. Okay, well, I can at least do trade with you. Sell off some of my crap that I'm not going to use. Especially the stuff that I took off of your former captives, or rather captors, I should say. Because captives insinuates they were on your payroll, not the other way around. Okay, anyway. Uh, it makes sense. They would need a fence to then sell off the stuff that they're pulling out of people. And an unwitting captive is possibly the best way to do that. Still sucks for him that he was stuck in that for as long as he was. But, I mean, hey. Now he's freed. Doesn't have to worry about it anymore. That's the important part. It's the dead eye thing. That's good. Uh, There was something I picked up. Showtime. What did I pick up? I remember picking up something. It was the incendiary round. That's what I picked up. Explodes on impact. That's for the projectile system, isn't it? Explodes on impact and deals thermal damage. The small chance to apply burn. Hmm. Hmm. That would be for the arms projectile system. Huh. Time's kind of tight here. Since when do y'all... Since when do y'all talk back to me while I'm sitting here? Since when did that start? Fuck you. I'm gonna sit here even longer now. Because fuck you. Time's kind of tight here. 
Something's going to be tight. My arms are on your throat in a second. All right. Um, I kind of, I kind of very much want this. Uh, but I, I'm, I'm not willing to spend that yet. Not yet. Bye. Oh, you're just gonna... okay. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm doing things down here. The what? Oh, Bitoro. Alrighty. Well. Here's hoping he only goes legit from now on. Common items. Cyberware usage and its side effects. I think we've read this. Yes, I'm pretty sure we have. There's stuff up there, too. Stuff only up here. Okay. Well, that makes sense. Alright. But first things first. I can connect to this one. Haha! <laughs> Beautiful. All right, he then. Hmm. Hmm. I can aim for one and three, but I'm probably going to lose out on two. Yeah, I had a feeling. But, works out. I get all the good stuff. Alright, fantastic. And now, I'm pretty sure I've looted this place thoroughly as possible. And get the data bank. And call Sandra Dorshit. Carpe Noctum. Oh, I can crack this and find out what's on it. Oh. Hmm. Is it worth it, though? I'm going to... Very quickly... Sava the Gamma... And find out. Well, I tried. Um, still can't find a way to decrypt it after I've put it in my inventory again, which doesn't make sense, but okay. And let's call her. V. You're V, right? You find the data bank? Someone's back in tip-top shape. Trauma must have put you back together in no time. Yep. Good as new. Still, if not for you, wouldn't have been anything left to put back together. Never got the chance to thank you properly. Wasn't there someone else with you? Big guy? Hmm. Whenever you get a chance, tell him I said thanks. Um, yeah, about that. Jackie's dead. <sighs> no. My condolences. It wasn't because of me, was it? No. He was killed by Arasaka. It wasn't too long after we found you. Jackie always had too much cool to let anyone know he gave a shit, but... After everything you went through, he'd be happy you remembered him. Anyway, what matters is that we're still alive. Now, um... About that, uh... The data bank, do you have it? Right to the chase, huh? Well, you'll never guess where I found it. A scav hunt. 
Sandra, you there? Yeah, it's just that. Well, ever since they told me what happened, I just can't stop seeing them. I figured they must have had it. But, you know, it's not like I was going to go looking for it myself after. <sighs> I keep telling myself it's over. The ones who took me are gone. Listen, you've got Trauma Team Platinum. It couldn't be in better hands. I'm sure they already fixed the Sig Jammer exploit. True. But who knows what the scavs will cook up next time? <laughs> anyway, that's all in the past now. Got bigger fish to fry. You want to talk about it? It's nothing. Just bring the data bank to my apartment. Sending you the address now. Thanks. Alrighty. Well, now I kind of feel somewhat bad that I wanted to try and decrypt that thing. But... No big. No big at all. Oh! Oh! Didn't know that this was an option to get in here. And because it's not all that obvious. Oh! Well, hello there. Oh, well, that's locked, but... That would be how to do the... Okay. Technically, that was an option. An option that wasn't readily obvious at the time, but was an option. And I can open this too. Okay, cool. Alrighty. I guess... When it comes to the other mission, I just... Call her for that? Um. Gig, which was last login. Deposit the laptop in the drop point. Okay. Alrighty. Well, drop point is. Over here, maybe? No. No, it wouldn't. Where would the drop point be? It should be nearby, wouldn't it? I would assume so. Uh, drop point is that away. That is a ways away. Wait, nope. That one's closer. Alrighty. Time to head over there and get that done. So, looks like we found the last honest cop in this city. Oh, yeah? Her name's Anna Hamill, and whatever she's investigating, it's made her a lot of enemies. She'd do best to cut it out if you catch my drift. This is Kabuki. Uh, okay, look, I know how it sounds, but somebody would have taken this gig anyway, right? Come on, I don't need this. I don't know. Maybe there's an angle you can play here. Either way, info's attached. Okay. And they call nomads thieves. Fine. Fine. Gun for hire. Okay, gun for hire. That makes me a little concerned. Okay, a lot of concerned. Force Anna Hamill to drop her police investigation. It's a blue-blooded cop through and through. The kind you'd expect to see in some NCPD promo. Beautiful, smart, honest to a fault. In other words, a really bad fit for Night City. Her NCPD colleagues are another story. They all have back problems from sitting on fat wallets. This current case Hamill's working on has them all breaking out in hives. She's digging into the smuggling racket in Kabuki Market, which, if she makes any real headway, means bad business for her cop buddy's finances. They want someone from outside the precinct to nip this in the bud. Normally, that's where I'd leave it, but I want to add one more thing. I kind of feel bad for the girl. Rather she not flatline if you can avoid it. Convince her to skip town, or drop the case and make a career change at least. You know, I mean, yeah, it's going to be the only other option we got in that regard, but I got other things cooking. Mainly with Sandra.
so might as well run to her apartment. Almost never use my car nowadays. It's insane how little I use my car. Entering Little China. Wow. I can go a ways with my stamina bar. Jesus. Whoop. Now I'm uh, a little worn out, but it's fine. There we go. Okay. Since you're just going to sit there, I'm going to go around your car. Sounds like Kuroshi kind of runs things like Apple does. Alright. In we go. Head on up to the apartments. Okay. And here we are at Sandra's. Sandra, it's me, V. I got your data bank. Sandra, you in there? Are you alone? Did anyone follow you? What does it look like? Come on. Don't like leaving the door open. That's fair. Still worried about the scabs? Whoa. My um friend told me your memory'd be scraped clean. The scavengers? No, I'm worried about. Um, no, it doesn't matter. You're worried you about something the data else. Bank? If it's not the scabs you're worried about, then who? Look, I didn't pay you to come here and ask me personal questions. Hey, you mentioned it. Besides, I saved your life. That isn't worth anything? It was worth whatever you got paid. Don't pretend I wasn't just another small-time job for you. Now, did you bring the data bank? Yeah. Here. Don't worry. It's completely intact. When someone tells me not to worry, it usually means they're hiding something. Mm -hmm. You wouldn't happen to have seen what's inside, would you? I'm a professional. I have a reputation to uphold. Hmm. Good. Then here you go, for your professionalism. I threw in a little extra for minding your own data. Thanks. Be seeing you. Nice. That worked out. And done. Cool. Now I'm kind of curious how it would have gone had I uh, broken <laughs> into it. Eh, it's probably for the best. I don't know. Probably for the best is the key phrase. All right. So, mission stuff. I just got done with that. Let's go ahead and figure out why. There we go. Why the drop point I tried to go to wasn't good enough. Or maybe it was just because I was trying to use the drop point while not having the mission as my primary focus. If that's the case, that's dumb. <laughs> I mean, I get it, but that's dumb. 
And, whoa. That could have been bad. Wee. All right. And before I run out of stamina... I am very quickly going to... There we go. Make it there without much issue. Hopefully. This is dicey. Okay. Hey, there's a drop point. Good. Deposit. Job item. Booyah. Prime V. Exactly the tech I wanted. Thanks. Get closed. Okay. Good. I guess. Oh. Something bad happened here. Trauma team is here. That means no good. Someone deaded it on the side of the street. Just jaywalking. <laughs> Jesus. Or it's saying walk. Hmm. Now it's saying don't walk when it was saying wait. Okay, whatever. Something's broken. That's all I know. It's always something. Okay. Well, let's help that one cop next. Huh? The woman of La Mancha. Sure. Let's go ahead and help her out. Ask around the market around about Anaheim. Okay, I can do that. We don't miss anything. For me, it's the birds. Songs in the morning. Okay. Okay. All right. Not sure what's going on here. I have no idea what this is about. And, quite frankly, I don't want to know. <laughs> it's pointing me in the wrong direction for a little bit there. That was bad. Whew. Okay. Some more max stock stuff. And... Hmm. Make me take the long way around, huh? All right. Go this way. And... Ah, this way. When's the next delivery? Two days. Hmm. Guess I could ask them, maybe. Or are you just a shopkeeper? Guess you're just a shopkeeper, okay. Huh. Hauling goods through all of NC can't be the safest of jobs. You ever run into any trouble? If you're trying to sell me protection, take it the fuck elsewhere. Already got Takeshi. This ours is. Sue me for being curious. Sure. Whatever. Know this woman? 30 something, slightly shorter than yourself. Heard she comes around here a lot. This is Kabuki. We get a lot of people. And smart asses? A lot of them, too? Yeah. Smart asses too. Smart asses who can recognize a cop's face. So how about it? You know her? I might. Depends on how much you'll be spending on your uh, groceries today. You're telling me you're harboring a badge while operating at a tiger claw turf? I, I wouldn't. I swear it. Oh, I believe you. But them? You know what they do to liars? Slice their digits off. Clean. Mm -hmm. Sometimes they even go further than that. All right. All right, I get it. The girls are renting out a room in this here motel. Right over there. Thank you. I appreciate it. Hey, break a hundred for me? This is definitely Tiger Claw Turf. All over the damn place take that old vinyl. Okay, what? 
Uh, oops. Hey, are you for real? <sighs> Getting money out of me anyway. Well, what? We're delighted to welcome you as our newest guest. Your room number is 203. We wish you a pleasant stay. This is an automated message. Please do not reply. Go into the motel. Yes. Oh. Had I known this was an option, I would have gone this way. God damn it. I feel stupid. Ah. It's locked. T playing on a cabinet with nothing on the screen. <laughs> oh, that's funny. That's funny. Take that, since you just left it there. Bye. Uh, 203. It's mine. I guess this is mine. Means I'm going to go into this. Hmm. Some of these are easy to do. Yeah, this one should be easy. 1C, 1C, 55, 55, 55 E9, 55. Booyah! Knew I could do it. Lottery scratch card. Well, I mean, that's something. That was not what I intended to do. <laughs> but okay. Sure. Why not? Alright. Open. Oh, nice little balcony. Cool. Damage clothes. Spray paint. Coffee. Should have drank that, if anything. And dinamite. Okay. And other things. Didn't expect that. Okay. I have no idea what that is. The fact that I can allegedly pick it up while not actually being able to is hilarious. Alright, I think I have to go further up to the next room. And that would be hers, I'm sure. Yep. 203. It was mine. 303. Right above mine is hers. Confront. Whoop. Stop! Not one more fucking step! Who put out the hit? Give me a name! Anna, drop this investigation. It's in your best interest. That a threat? I'd remind you, you're the one in the fucking crosshairs. Hey, easy. I just want to help. Help? Phonic implant must be fried. I think you men intimidate. Just to end your investigation. Really pissed off the wrong people. Which people? Tell me what fucking people! Your buddies at the NCPD set you up. Fucking. Fucking knew it! Robert Kowalski and Bill Adams! Wouldn't surprise me. Motherfuckers! Let it go. It's not worth it. Yeah. Know what? I'm not letting scumbag get me killed! Fuck them! Fuck this job! Fuck this city! Fair enough. Guns down. I feel I can safely approach. So, Anna, what's next for you? What? We choons all of a sudden? The hell do you care? I dropped the case like you wanted. You can fuck off, Merc. Okay. That's fair. 
And Got uh, nothing to say to you, June. All right. Well, I'm just gonna take some things then. All right. Among all notable Netrunner groups or cells in recent year, found in translation has undoubtedly emerged as the most infamous. The m four members of the group, known only by their aliases JD, AP, SK, and BPM, primarily target major brain dance studios and productions. First reported cyber attacks perpetrated by Found in Translation were breaches of studio data fortresses that contained brain dance files slated for release. They made slight adjustments to the recording data in order to replace positive emotions toward corporations with hot blooded hate and to erase corporate logos that were planted for promotional purposes. Makes sense. In July 2076, after FIT altered version of the Braindance Badlands raid hit the market in the Pacific Northwest, many consumers took to the streets of Seattle in a surge of violent anti-corporate riots. Good. Following the incident, studios tightened security measures and law enforcement authorities formally recognized FIT as a terrorist cell that posed a significant risk to public safety and order. Right. In response, FIT adapted its tactics. Rather than solely launching attacks on brain dance producers, they have begun to infiltrate domestic and commercial brain dance units to corrupt or alter data. Their most recent data manipulation attacks on the brain dance's Wasteland Fury and Slave to the Supervisory Board have cemented their reputation as a formidable nut running cell that refuses to yield to outside pressure. Cool. And you have a purple thing here that I want. Ooh, frayed scav combat shirt. Beautiful. Can't turn that down. In the slightest. Pleasure to meet you, Anna. Have a good one. Bye bye. Alrighty. And down we go. And down we go. Oh, that's in there. That makes sense. Okay. Huh. I... Okay. We're in the clear. It's back here, I'm in the clear. Take all of this. Ooh. Amethyst Speed Nanoplastic Rally Bolero. Hmm. Decent amount of stuff and a decent amount of money. And I can connect to one of these. Okay. Well. Uh, I just noticed that I had apparently dropped a lot of frames. Uh, not paying attention. Also, I'm way over time for this episode. So, uh, I'm going to finish this up and uh, end the episode here for right now. So, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. Click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together and I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat. Playing games and doing what I can to make it through uh, <laughs> this playthrough. That also uh, help out people where I can and make a whole bunch of money in the process and hopefully manage to get that done soon for you.